Hi, welcome back. Terry O'Reilly here, founder of OBP Australia. In this video, we're going to explore the equation E equals SP squared. Stay tuned. So E equals SP squared, where E equals employment, S stands for strategy, and P, perseverance. Are you doing any of these things? Sending off dozens of applications per week. Sending off dozens of LinkedIn requests to people you don't know. Are you relying solely on recruiters? Are you relying solely on formal applications? Are you paying a professional resume writer to write a single static version of your resume and hoping that does the trick? Are you equating time spent on seek.com with productivity? If you are, I suggest that this is not really a strategy. It's more wishful thinking. Now, stay positive. This is my solution to the problem here. What you need is a sound methodology developed in consultation with somebody who knows the system. Get some practical advice on how you can change the way you're approaching your job seeking by doing the following. If you're struggling in Australia to establish professional peer networks that can provide access to the hidden job market, get advice. If you're not receiving interview call-ups, if you don't know how to contact employers directly when there are no jobs advertised, if you're failing at the interview stage, if you're frustrated by lack of progress, or if you're simply unsure where to start with your job seeking process, contact OBP Australia. Let's have a look at perseverance. One thing about perseverance is very easy to say to people, you've just got to keep trying. Well, that's true because the alternative is unthinkable. But perseverance becomes a lot easier uh, when you know that your methodology is sound. If you're putting in a whole lot of energy and there's no reward, it's devastating. So three things I suggest we need to do to help you with that perseverance is one, to identify your barriers, weaknesses and your knowledge gaps. There could be something that is stopping you from taking that step forward. So we need to know what it is. That's the first thing, identifying the barriers. Secondly, seek guidance and support from experienced and knowledgeable people. And finally, establish a strategy for finding work. So the things that I mentioned before are what I would call lazy approaches to finding work. Get some advice. Uh, you should be positive about your future. You will get a job in Australia if you are qualified and experienced and you go about it in the right way. It may take a little bit longer than you had hoped, but the first thing is to get on the right track do that you need some advice and support so contact us go to obpaustralia.com.au click on inquire now and we'll get back to you within 24 hours to organize a time to discuss your options don't forget to subscribe down below see you next time